What's up everybody? Anthony from Granddaddy Herbs. Let's see if we can get these um, baby garter snakes to eat today. There we go. Leave it to the little one. They eat really fast too. These are just little pieces of silver sided fish. Awesome. Hopefully, eats a little bit more now that it realizes that that stuff there is food. It's like thinking about it. Little one doing doing work today. It's like shoot if they don't want it, I'll take it. Crazy how you can feed it like little pieces of fish just to a snake, and it'll do, it'll just take it. Oops. My channel goals here in the next year or so get me a much better HD camera. This one does an alright job, but I'm too used to it. I'm, I'm looking for something that's got better quality so I can make better videos. Come on little guy, it's your turn. Come on. This one just got pissed on the left because it was trying to crawl out. And then I dropped that little piece of fish and then it, it went after it and put it in its mouth like all quick. So like I said, these guys like to see their food move. They are opportunistic feeders, so anything that's small moving, you know, and they have the opportunity to get it, they will. These guys aren't constrictors, so whatever they eat, they take it alive. And they'll eat it while it's still alive. There's videos of, of garter snakes eating frogs and stuff, and you'll see the frogs still alive. Damn, little one's still, still taking it down. I didn't think it was that big of a piece, but alright. Glad I got a nice meal in him. I'm going to start taking him out when I feed him. Aw, oh, don't let it go, buddy. I knew that was going to happen. The sensation of it being alive wiggling... They they get it down much faster because this wasn't wiggling, it wasn't doing that. All right, give it another go. Come on, little guy. Maybe if I like wiggle it a little bit, you know what I mean? Make it try to get it down quicker. <laughs> Look at the little one. Hurry up and eat already, so we can go play. <laughs> My little guy, you got it. Get it down. Little one showing you up.
I know you guys want to see him eat live stuff. I'll I'll get that video to you guys. This one has a wicked head stamp that I just love. Got like these two dots on the top of its head. Done. Alright, I'm gonna offer it one more piece and we'll call it a day on the little one. See if I got like a little piece I can give it. Yep, the little one's calling her today. I just love the unique pattern that the head scales make. These are really cool looking snakes for sure. Very similar looking to like your corn snake. Awesome. I'm really liking this bigger one here. The colors are just popping. The other one looks like it just needs a little bit more growth. And its colors should, should start to come out a little bit a little bit brighter. Like this big one's got more of the purples showing. The other one doesn't really have purples. It's more of like a a light pattern right now. you guys to see the belly got a nice big lump in it look at that nice and full and this one's pushing it down Let's see if this one will take one more go it's kind of like some ball pythons you know it's like you got to wiggle the frozen thawed prey in order for it to you know to eat it to entice it okay let me kind of wiggle it get them going much quicker nom 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 Can't wait to feed these guys some earthworms, man. When I was younger and I had my first garter snake and my ribbon snake, I used to love feeding them guard, uh, earthworms. And at the time I was young and dumb, I used to catch them on rainy days and just throw it in the tank. But it's not a really good idea because those are wild type worms, so they could carry parasites and stuff. Never had any issues with my snakes. Is you know these guys are reptiles. You know their their immune systems, even though they're in, captivity I mean they're pretty strong I mean these guys have some acidic like stomachs you know what I mean they'll just melt anything it takes in but yeah guys uh, sorry for the long video hope you guys enjoy um, a couple people asked me to make a feeding video of these guys so you know nothing live just yet but we'll get some live stuff in here uh, real soon within the next couple days or so alright guys Anthony from Granddaddy Herbs peace